Greetings and welcome to Halfling 13 Gaming. Today we have a battle report between the forces of the Shadow Collective and the Separatist Alliance. Coming in as our fourth tournament match for the Battle of the Golden Vader tournament and a conclusion of round one. Over the course of many of the following weeks, follow along with our players in a battle for dominance and victory in the Dummel Elimination Tournament, all to be the first to claim the newly crafted Traveling Trophy. Shadow Collective is being led by Gar Saxon, with some hired assistance from Cad Bane. They're fielding four units of Black Sun Enforcers, with a proxy Death Trooper unit for one of the groups, and two units of Mandalorian Super Commandos. The Separatist Alliance has a super tactical droid Kalani in command, Bring to the field four units of B-1 battle droids and a unit of B-2 super battle droids. They also have two units of IG-100 Magna Guard and a single unit of BX series droid commandos with a DSD-1 dwarf spider droid for firepower. Our tournament consists of several passes, with all players playing a fixed army list against all other players. No alterations or adjustments are permitted without approval, and all battles use the same terrain layout and arrangement for a given round. In an effort to involve our viewers, we're asking for your feedback. As usual, point out any mechanics errors that we miss, as well as offer any advice to our existing players, either tactics or unseen combos. At the end of each week, the players will be rated on the number of mechanics errors. We we'll use this score to decide the results of any battles resulting in a tie, instead of the usual points destroyed mechanic. So your feedback may help the player advance or be held back. As always, we welcome our viewers, both past and present. All 3D models used are available either on Thingiverse or from various companies. Please check the description for details. The scoreboard and dice trays are a custom design, inspired by many others, but developed and crafted by Halfling 13. Of course, post a comment if you spot any errors we miss, or if you have suggestions for tactics changes, or just to help us improve for the next match. We welcome all constructive feedback as we work to improve, and steadily add more and more paint to the forces we use. With the complexity of Legion, it's a challenge avoiding mistakes, but it's an enjoyable learning experience. Please consider a like on this video or subscribe to the channel. Your support and feedback is appreciated and helps us continue creating content. We post new videos most weeks on Friday. Activating Kalani, and Kalani is going to strategize both himself and the B2s. Then Kalani will make a climb action up these stairs. And then orbital strike across the field at Gar Saxon. Uh, surge to hit. Yikes. Negative surge to hit. So that's four. You can spend a shield token. Yep. Bye. Like. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay. Great. Okay. Two Down. wounds and two suppression from this. Um. It, it was our great grandfather. Or I think it was our great grandfather. I drew a core unit, so this core unit is going to activate my Vigo, who is the core, core unit, is going to move here, and then here, and the rest of the units are going to pile in. Right, I'm going to activate this red squad here. They are going to aim and shoot the rocket launcher at the black zone. Where'd that core unit go? Let me aim. Three. All right. Um. Did you cover it all? Nope. So. Two guys. I activated a core unit, so this core unit is going to move up, claim the box, and then enter standby mode. Alright. Does the box go away? No. He gets the resistance go. Or targeting pass up, um, uh, range by range. I'm 
them to choose precision scopes. Activate this squad of B1s. They are going to move up. So they are just in range. To shoot that unit right there. And... Oh my nothing. god! Nothing. I drew a core unit. So this core unit is going to take two moves to move as close as they can to that lake. Well, and then I am not in range to grab that. So I'm gonna go ahead and go with these special forces here. They have to AI move. So I'm gonna come this way. And then attack at range five with the sniper, Gar Saxon. Two hits. One for cover. Roll for one. Right. Nothing. Take a damage. Crushing. You know, I've always wanted to use them. He likes it with rebels because then he can run away laying yeah. down. Is... I drew a special forces unit. So my special forces unit is going to move and then jump in order to get up onto this piece of terrain. Made yeah, the two inch jump. Activate the blue squad. They are going to aim and shoot everything at the super commanders on the building. I'll spend the surge here. Of course. I will roll the aim for these. <laughs> One more. Two. Go away for heavy cover. And you do have the shield two shields, but to your oh, there's no there's no functional reason. To there's two shields. Okay. Roll for two. Do you have a search token? Uh, nope. I don't know why there's a search token in there. But I do not. You got a search token for using I do search, don't they? Think they search to defend. Yeah. I got fancy armor. Nice. All right. Just take one suppression. I swear to God, uh, they didn't have them for a while. I didn't think they did, at least. Yeah, they did. That was the big issue that I thought I had with them. I, uh, I drew Gar Saxon. Gar Saxon is first going to rally to see if he rolls off any of his suppression. Nope. He is going to use Compel. I believe. No. Compel is not the single action one, so he is just going to, with his one action, he is going to move. Over to here. Alright, I'm going to activate the white B1s. They are going to make a move and take a shot yeah. at Gar Saxon with the sniper rifle. It is. I just need to move to about right there. And make sure the sniper rifle also has a line of sight. And then they'll go here. Just one, goes to cover. Does that still give us oppression? Yeah. Yep. Oh, okay. Yep. Direct man Mando. Mando Super Commando Squad. They are going to take a dodge and then a standby action. We activate the B2s. They are going to move. 
So they are range three, so about like that. And then shoot at the super commandos on the building. So we're going to just spend one surge and you will have to roll for four. One saved, or three saved. Not terrible. Not terrible, not what I wanted, but you know. This guy's not standing on his little guy. There. And another suppression, please. I see one hiding up there. Yep. Okay. You are up. This unit is going to activate and then make two moves. For measuring sake. I drew the spider droid, he has to AI aim, and then he will shoot the super commandos on the building. So we surge to hit. I will re-roll one. Two for cover. Up another suppression on him. Who are you shooting at? These guys. And back to the stack is just the Magna Guards. And Two of them? Yeah. Alright, so last unit is the Magna Guards, we're going to dodge standby. Okay. And then one more unit is the Magna Guards, we're going to dodge and standby to end the round. Alright, so we're going to start here. Just rotate and then we're going to pivot 90 degrees. Speed to move. About like that. There we go. There. Going to pivot 90 degrees. Then make a speed to move. Activated a core unit. This core unit is going to move up and then into the lake. I drew Kalani, and Kalani is going to strategize and give the B2s aim and a dodge, and the uh, rocket launcher squad over here an aim and a dodge, and then Kalani is going to pop back down. I activated a core unit, so the squad is going to perform two move actions.
to pile in. I'm going to activate the BX droids. They are going to aim and then shoot. The sniper is going to shoot through the stairs at Gar Saxon. And my unit leader uh, does have line of sight and range on the super commandos and he'll throw a shot up there. Okay, two aims, or two hits. I will spend the aim to make it pierce one. One goes from cover, so. He is impervious, so. Two dice. Yep. Both saved. Nice. Fair enough. <laughs> expression and the other guy will shoot his regular gun which is two guys when Gar Saxon's almost dead two wipes uh, up at the super commandos uh, surge to hit goes to cover but they take the suppression the suppression is gonna be what ends up causing me to lose I drew my uh, special ops units. They are going to move and then then perform a standby action up to the bomb cart. I'm going to activate the red squad. They are going to aim and shoot everything up into the super commandos. No, I can't find okay. we'll Dead. Spend a Dead. surge token on this one. And I will spend the aim on these two. Two more. To go away to your heavy cover. Roll for four. They're dead. Oh. That is lucky. That. Yeah, the on the tower. I'm going to use the fast token. I'm going to activate this B2 squad. They are going to recover and then shoot at Cad Bane. Two, three. Spend the aim. Cad Bane only has white dice. A lot of de defense. You have a cached dodge. I know. I'm taking him. Okay. I'm going to dodge one of your dice. Sure. And then, does he surge? Yeah, he surges to defend. So, one hit. Okay, one hit, one surge. I actually have to look for the defense dice. <clears throat> I'm gonna activate Gar Saxon. Gar Saxon is going to Panic if he doesn't roll off any of these dice, any of these suppression. He rolled off one, so he's not panicked. So he still gets one action. He's going to ready. So we're readying his shields and removing suppression. Gray squad, they are going to aim and shoot everyone. Cad Bane. So two. Spend the aim. One more. You have one cover from the suppression. So. Yep. Just the two. Or three dice. One saved. So, yep. Another wound and another suppression. Do you get one extra dice per suppression, or just one extra one if you have suppression? suppression? Up to a limit. Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, Danger said three or four, and that's the What limit. is it? Three. Three. Okay. Yeah, so at three so suppression, he gets three extra dice. After that, he doesn't get any extra. Gotcha. Danger sense that you uh, can You put the wrong token on there. Yes, I did. <laughs> nah, I'll, I'll take the four. I drew my last core unit. So this squad is going to claim the box for one for the free action, move, and then perform a standby action. So they're going to... Move here, so I bumped it by accident. Alright. Alright. All over yours. Let's go camp.
I'm going to choose Hollow Projector. Activate the blue squad of B1s, and they are going to move up to here and fire everyone into Cad Bane. A different? I don't know. I'm going to spend the surge here. I'll we'll spend a aim. For one more. You have one for your cover from suppression. Yep. Roll for three. So, Danger Sense 2. That's very good. That's just three damage. Right? <sighs> Not five. Thing. Wait, how much health does he have? Uh, Six. Okay. Pretty close. <sighs> That's super close. Ed Bane is going to act. He has to roll off a suppression. Yep. Two suppression. That's actually rather bad for me. Yeah, three, right? Danger sense. Cad Bane is going to didn't help you move <laughs> into range to shoot them via um, steady. So fires at that squad, and then he is going to jump back over to here. Four, four hits. One. So there's one pierced one. Take four damage. And the suppression. Suppression. And we go. One, two, three, four. Seven. A unit leader and a dude left. This is great. I'm going to activate this unit of Magna Guards. They are going to move. They're going to take a second move. Reveal the oh, yep, it? yep. Oh, nothing. 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 So continue. Excellent. Oh, hold on. Where's the other one? Over here. Am I in range one? No. Or Sons of the Vigo. Right oh, I yeah. think I'm outside yeah, of range you're one. You're outside of range one. Make sure. <sighs> Forgot about okay. that. You are currently out of range. Yep. Then. Now I'm going to make a move, a climb action. Mm -hmm. Right here to become adjacent. Mm -hmm. And then. That will that will put you in range. Trigger this one, which is which that one is a bomb. Bomb. Okay, so and so I'll get bombed, and then I'll make my relentless attack against Cat Bane. Let's start with the Vigo score. Okay. I just wondered why you're doing this. Is it surge to crit? Surge to crit. Okay. So three. Blast two. Impact. Blast impact two. It's right. impressive. Three. Three on the Vigo squad. Surge? No. Okay, so one guy died. There's one, two, two suppression. My guys first or Cad Bane? First. Cad Bane. Right. Of course, I hit every dice. Yep, another four. If you want to dodge, you're very much hit. Dodge. Okay. And then you That's have one. suppression. You have one suppression, so you can get one extra dice. So four. Dice. four. Dice. Those are wrong dice. Slow down. Do you have a fourth one? Yeah. He's dead. Okay. Right here, put the dice Damn. under, like right there. Okay. And then 
and roll your four dice versus the... Watch. I miss every one of these. Okay. Uh, three. Three. And I don't surge the block. Um, I block three. Okay. Two suppression. Two suppression. Alright. Activate this squad of black sun. First I have to roll off this purple. Which they do. Okay. Didn't know if it was all symbols or not. They are going to make an aim and then fire at. They have one or two actions that are each other. I don't know if Rico gets them extra. They do. They get one extra. So they have one, two actions. They are going to aim and then fire at the Mag Magna Guard squad. I'm going to use one fragmentation grenade. Oh, damn. That's my scattergun enforcer and my double blaster. Nothing. Nope, nope. Yep. Here are all these three. Nice. So that's two. Take two away for heavy cover. Yeah, hold on. Uh, Pierce. Pierce one. And that's it. Okay. Okay. Rolling for two. Block. One hit. Both of them. Pierce one. I'll make it the guy with the rocket launcher. And an extra suppression. Um, they are immune to melee pierce, so that's the one unfortunate circumstance where I couldn't do much there. Activate this unit of Magna Guard, and they are going to take a move. Take a subsequent move into melee this unit, and use charge to make a free melee attack. Take two. One second. Okay. Nice. I'm going to activate the spider droid. He's going to aim and shoot the black suns here. So that will be two hits there. Crit, spend. Aim to re-roll with precise two. For another surge to hit. And you have heavy cover. So roll for two. Nice. Well saved. Suppression. Alright, I'm gonna activate the white sniper squad here. They are going to aim and shoot at Gar Saxon again. There's one hit. I would argue it is cover. Uh, yes, he has heavy cover. Yeah, heavy. That's one hit. It's not going to mean anything, so I'm going to spend the aim to reroll both of them. Uh, it has critical one, so that is one crit. Our Saxon is saved. So, mm -hmm. another suppression. And that's everyone. Okay. Alright, moving the cart. There we go. Oh my gosh, this is so finicky. Here we go.
activated core unit, so I'm going to activate this unit inside the lake. They're going to aim and then shoot at that squad of B1s. <coughs> yeah, yeah, it is a good thing. Three hits. Aim, one aim. Mm -hmm. Three roll these three dice. Mm -hmm. Two aims to re-roll these three dice. Two hits. Final aim to roll these three dice. Two hits with that last set. Okay. So you're looking at... They do not have cover, I would assume. Because uh, I'm shooting cover. out of I'm shooting out of the heavy cover. But they have light cover through these boxes. boxes so it's one off. Yep. Alright, so minus one. I'll dodge one. Minus another one. So I'll roll for one, two, three, four, five. Mm-hmm. I'll block three. Lose two. With white dice. It's on her. This Kalani. Kalani is going to strategize the B2s and this blue squad here, giving them aim and dodge. And then Kalani is going to take a move. Up. Commando, Super Commandos, they are going to move and then move, and then claim a box. Then, yeah. This box, we have a field scanner, and we have camouflage. Camouflage. I'm going to activate this unit of Magna Guard. They have to roll for suppression. I'm going to take one off. Then they're going to climb down the stairs. Dodge three. Then they're going to move to these guys. Use Relentless to make a melee attack. So the surge to hit. Right, roll four five. Yeah, They're gone. that's about average. They're gone. Five red dice, and I miss every one of them. That's why I didn't want to use them all, because I always miss all the all red dice and. I figure I saved myself a lot of pain and suffering if I... Those two are going to activate. Hopefully they're going to roll off a suppression. No. No suppression rolled off. So they have one action. They're going to... Two red dice at the squad that's engaging them. One hit. I can re aim to re-roll that. Sorry. Two hits. Two blocks. Activate the spider droid, and he is going to recover to get his blaster back, and then shoot the blaster into these black zones. So that is two, but you have heavy, heavy cover. cover. So I'll just take a suppression. Activated a core unit. This core unit with two F, two aims are going to move and then perform a standby action. Activate the BX droids, they have to take an AI dodge or move, and theirs is going to be a dodge, and then they're just going to shoot the sniper 
again at Gar Saxon, and the leader is going to shoot into this unit of Black Suns. Uh, so just one heavy cover, though, yeah. or light cover, rather, and then the suppression leader. Yeah, and suppression. The leader is going to shoot at the guys in the crater for a crit. Roll it. Lose a guy, take a suppression. Activated my last unit, Gar Saxon. Gar Saxon is going to jump up here. Roll for suppression. Roll for suppression first. One suppression off. He is going to jump up here. And then fire at this squad of B1s with his Galar rifle. Three hits. No blocks. So yeah. He actually Suppression. killed something. Two, three. Just the leader and the heavy remain. Yep. All right. Activate the red squad in retaliation to recover, get their rocket launcher back, and shoot both guys back up at Gar Saxon. Damn. Just one. Just a suppression. I'm going to use my shield. <laughs> Sorry. All right. Now activate these Magna Guards. They are going to aim and punch. Just go, punch. Magna Guard, go. No. Surge to hit. <laughs> Any token? One more. Roll for five. Oh. Wow. Well, lose one. Sorry. You should be. Activate the B2s. They are going to move forward to right there. And they are going to take a shot. Looks like only in range of the T-Series. Just going to throw his dice at these black sides. Heavy cover as well. One hit. Uh, Probably. Game. Yeah. For. Uh, I'll spend the surge. So take expression. They are very suppressed. Good. I'm going to activate the white squad of B1s here. They are going to take a slight reposition to get out of the way of the bomb cart. Shuffle in to here. Shuffle on in there. In there. Sniper. Over here. And over here. And then they are going to take the sniper shot into those black suns. One hit, one suppression. All right, the blue squad here is going to activate. They are going to recover and shoot everything into these black suns. That would have been helpful. Smoke grenades. So we're going to take the surge for that. Spend the aim. These two. For nothing. So cover takes away those. Roll for two crits. Yep. One moment. Fuck him loose. Nope. This two takes suppression. Still kind of swords the payload. I'm going to activate this two man unit of gray B1s. They're going to make a slight move adjustment. To help maintain the chain. Uh, let's check. He's good there. He's good to there. And then they are going to shoot two guys into those black suns. Singular. Uh, one cover. To cover. Take a suppression. 
<laughs> and I think that's everyone. All right, bomb cart's going. It's gonna go. so slightly. I'm going to activate Gar Saxon. Gar Saxon is going to jump up here. And then fire at the spider droid. I'm gonna re-roll this dice using one of my aim tokens. They're, those two are upgraded to crits via mm -hmm. impact. Uh, does he have sharpshooter? Yes, he has a sharpshooter. Oh. Blast. Blast. Okay. Blast. 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 Go for three. Surge defend. Block one, take two. If you please. In the red squad of B ones, they are going to recover, get their rocket launcher back, and then shoot at Lone Black Zone. Surge to recover. They don't surge to defend. Oh, that's a black sun. I thought that was sorry. One of my core units. This core unit is going to move into the pool and shoot at the remaining B squad. B one. Get revenge on the B one squad that just killed their partner. So move up and then move in. One aim token to re-roll three dice. Yeah. Then <laughs> one aim token to re-roll the remaining three dice. Four hits. Okay, one for cover. They have pierce one. Block none, pierce one, they don't. Kills that squad. Yeah. Nice. Scattergun. No, they are not. Well, regardless, it, it, it they're doesn't the matter. I'm sorry, I'm getting confused. Activate the spider droid. It's going to aim and shoot at the super commandos over there. Oh, he's going to reload and shoot at the super commandos over there. Uh, so just two, one. Saved. Okay, one suppression. This Black Suns unit is going to disengage and disengage. into the box and you claim said box okay. may not take any additional so actions other than disengaging then he's not going to disengage in that direction 
he is going to disengage into that little crevice behind the plant. So, he is under this spot, but... Yeah. Activate the BXs. They are going to aim, and both of these guys are going to shoot up at Gar Saxon. Roll and not to make it lethal. Uh, heavy boring. Two more. Heavy, heavy cover. cover. Two crits. Two saved. Because I believe he surges. Yeah. So nice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Didn't he activate early? Yep, he did. Okay. This unit is the only unit that can activate left. They are going to grab the box. Roll for suppression. Roll for suppression. For suppression gone. They're going to retrieve the box, move, and then fire at the super commandos. Arc welder and grappling hooks. <laughs> Mother would do you a damn thing. <laughs> Both are irrelevant. You can't use either one for that. I know. Unless you want to repair a droid. No. Wait. Or falter. Activate. Then you turn. Yep. Thank you, universe. He was actually smart. Keeps it out of the deck for him. <laughs> She's going to move. You can jump. If you can jump straight. Oh, yeah. So you can go, go over that terrain. They don't move through, do they? Yes, they do. Oh, why are they there, not up here in your face? We want the arc welder. They're gonna move there. And then shoot at that squad of... Um... Command. <laughs> Do they surge? No, they don't. Hey, I hit you once, and cover is not affected because it's a crit. Yep, I will spend the shield on it. Which recharges if you want to? Yeah. Recharges when he uses the recharge, or the recover this action. This particular shield does. Activate Kalani. Roll off one suppression. Kalani will take another suppression to strategize and give... The B2 is an aim and a dodge, and then the sniper unit an aim and a dodge. And then Kalani is going to move around the building. Okay. I'm going to activate the B2s. They're going to recover, get their rocket launcher back, and they are in range for everyone to shoot up at Gar Saxon. Four, five. We're gonna spend the aim token. Find the droids in the wrong fashion. Oh, you find the droids in the wrong fashion. I am. For just one more. No surge. I'm gonna use a shield token to get one of those. Mm-hmm. Because actually remembering, I have it. Mm-hmm. And you're gonna have your cover. Yep. Uh, it has blast. Ow. The rocket has blast, but does it apply to yeah. everything? Yep. yep, the attack pool okay. gains blast. I can blast. never remember how that works. I don't think the rocket needs weapon defense. Uh, does he search to defend? He does, he does, but... He does, but the two wounds will kill him. Two wounds. Puts him up to... Die. Yes. I thought he had four. Five. He has five. Either way, he's dead. Well, yeah. Right, I'm going to activate this white squad of B1s. They are going to move up. Oh. I have one card left. And into range of mm -hmm. these guys. So we're right up there. And then everyone's going to fire into the black zones. Cards. So that'll be crit one. 
will spend the surge on this one. And then we'll spend the aim on these two for nothing else. So this goes away to your cover and three crits go through. Got those wall hacks. Uh, who is that at? That was nope. a black sun. So, just lose a guy. No suppression. Wall hacking droids. I'm just gonna get rid of Scout Gun Enforcer to save us some confusion. I'm gonna activate this squad of B1s. They are going to take a pot shot into the black sun and move back into some cover. Is moving out of heavy terrain? Two white, uh, one uh, blocked by cover, one suppression. Yep. Is moving out of ter heavy terrain? Yes. Activate this squad of B1s. They are going to move up. And they're going to fire everyone. Um, rocket launchers tap, so he's firing a regular gun at the Black Sun. Seven whites, one like surge. Driven. The Viper Pro droid can't shoot a normal uh, shot. That's nothing. That's a hit and a surge. So two hits go to heavy cover. Just a suppression. Those guys aren't acting. And I think that's. Uh, no, I haven't done either of the Magna Guards yet. I drew the Magna Guards. They're going to AI move and then make their attack against that guy. There's four. He will survive. Ah. Balls. Yep. Two units left. Final squad of Magna Guards is going to AI move. I'm going to move this, float it over the terrain, leave it kind of like that. And Kalani's dead. Red card. Slide it forward. Yeah. Touching. All right, I drew Kalani from my stack. I'm going to try to roll off suppression, which we do. Kalani is going to take a suppression to strategize and give the B2s an aim and a dodge and the sniper unit and aim and a dodge. And then Kalani is going to climb off the building. I'm gonna activate my core unit, one of the two units I have. They're going to hopefully roll off their suppression. Yep, so they have one action, because their courage is one. They are going to perform a standby action. So I'm gonna activate this white squad of B1s. They are going to take another aim and shoot everyone into the black sun. So that'll be crit one right there. This will be hit, 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 hit. I'll spend one aim, reroll two. I'll make the surge hit. I'll spend the other aim to reroll two. Another crit. You lose two to cover. Yep, you roll for five. Uh, three. Yeah, three saved. So, right, nice. two so one guy, and you take a suppression, which by definition removes the standby. Yeah. Oh, really? Mm -hmm. Unfortunately. Yeah, you know now you're, now well, you're panicked, right? Well, any if you take any suppression, the standby goes away. Oh wow! Activate. So you just gotta shoot anybody once, even if you don't hit them. That's that's, that's why that's sniper. dirty. That's why. Yeah. I'm gonna activate these Mandalorians. They are going to move, move, and then climb a box. Yeah. 
Boom. Jump up over here. And then climb this box. Alright. Field scanner. Med pack. Med pack. And hollow projector. Activate the unit of BX droids. They are going to move, make a push on the bomb cart. And then everyone's going to shoot up here at the fleeing Mandalorian. Oh no. Two now. So these are surges to hit. Alright, cover two. And you have two shields and a dodge. I'm going to dodge one of them. Use field scanner to dodge, to give myself a dodge token to dodge another. When does field scanner activate? While defending against a range attack, I'm going to apply dodge and cover step, gain one dodge token. Another Smart. one. And two shields then? Um, yeah, I can take away all the defense. Mm -hmm. Yeah, two shields. Okay. Yeah, awesome. Yeah. Well done, Ted. I can't worry about the spider droid. No ice, no ice. Yeah. I'm going to activate the spider droid. The spider droid is going to move down off the cover right there. And move again. Uh, which will displace this guy. Okay. Well, we get to make a speed one move with the leader. Hmm. Wherever the leader was closest to his position. The leader's right here. Okay. So move. You can move that droid. Speed one move. Ah, uh, that. Why? Why because are you he, giving? He displaced his own guys. Only models that get displaced move. No. They, yeah. The the the. the yeah. This unit got the displaced by the spider droid, so I'm gonna have the unit leader move back behind the spider droid in an attempt to block some line of sight. I drew the magna guards. They are going to move and. Move in. They are unhindered, so they can move through difficult terrain, no problem. Move, move, charge to make a melee attack. Hit. That's not going to happen here, but. Or? Nope. Oh, they don't surge. Damn, they surge. That would have been amazing. Just. Yeah, they're dead. He's dead. <coughs> and we got the uh, final unit of Magna Guards here, and they are going to <coughs> the line of sight thing that we had issued last time. Move up. Yeah. And move up. Line of sight thing? No. They would just get an order token and a surge, but they already surged too. <coughs> they would get a defend token. Via defend one. Because you give them an order. Yep, I give them an order. Okay. Alright, final shot was to move stay the, stay the BX droids up. And take a shot with everybody into the command of it. Ooh. So that's just a hit. A crit. No. Did you have a game over? Oh, wait, was that a crit? I think you bumped that. Okay. You yeah. your hand no, I didn't have a name because I had to move up. There you go, that's it. One dodge token to get rid of yep. your hit. Okay. And then, for the sake of... Saves it. Okay, yep. so, so at that point, you're going to not take any wounds. Your guys jump away. Everything's out of range to not be able to do anything on round, on round six. This is at the end here. Yeah, we moved up, moved up again. So, okay. So, final thing, we have the commandos fleeing for the hills, keeping themselves alive while the droids surge forward. But the shadow has accomplished their bomb mission, although they allowed the droids to do the same, resulting in a functional tie for the game. 
And now we will go to, if anybody made mistakes, as far as I can tell, nobody did, per se. Um, But we'll see if the viewers end up spotting it.